what's up my peeps before the video starts make sure to hit the subscribe button bell notifications so you don't miss another upload on this channel and let's get started hey guys boys and girls it's me josh bnsf here and today on this video we're actually going to be giving a huge shout out to the channel that's about to pop up on your screen now so there you go guys there's the channel make sure to go subscribe to this guy he is amazing with his editing and software and gameplay and channel help him to 1k um uh, I don't know if I'm really going to help him because my channel's dead, so I don't know how much it's going to help him. But if it does, guys, it would be amazing. He's a good fella. His Twitter and YouTube channel will be down in the link below. Make sure to go follow him. And before we get in the video, today we're going to be reacting to the video. I'll be reacting at the end after you watch the whole video. I did get permission from him to use his video to react. So please do not spam in the comment section below. If he comments on this video, I will pin him down in the comment section below for you, ladies and gentlemen. And like always, let's get started. And now, roll the clip. Accuracy, just pinpointing enemies with this like sight on the gun, it just works so so much better. It runs a lot smoother. So all I can really say is like basically gonna be short and sweet with the sights, but just use a reflex sight, it's amazing and it works really well. So the second attachment on this gun is fast mag. So this basically just allows you to reload faster. And the reason I put this on is because in Black Ops 4 there's a lot of timing issues. We basically when you're reloading, it's that slow. Some people usually like pop around the corner, and they'll kill you, it'll be like so frustrated. So just by putting this on, you're gonna just reload a lot quicker as well as say when you are in gunfights and you do find the kill someone then obviously you got to reload the gun because obviously it's low on ammo because me when i'm actually in gunfights as soon as i shoot my gun i always reload and with not using fast mags your gun will reload so so slow and as well as it being an ar it even reloads even slower so by just putting fast mags on you can basically reload the gun a lot quicker and just get back into the action so all i'm going to say is make sure you do put fast mags on this weapon so the third and final attachment on this weapon is actually quick draw now this basically just improves your aiming speed so when you you are running around the map being aggressive for this gun because the mad ox i'm telling you now this is what this gun's about i know it is an assault rifle but with this gun you need to be aggressive because it's absolutely awesome so by putting quick draw on this it just improves your aiming speed so when a guy does come around the corner you can snap on him through your scope get the kill keep moving you'll snap on the next guy and basically just by aiming in quicker in in one on one gunfire it gives you the better chance of killing someone and trust me it even ups your accuracy as well so make sure you do put quick draw on this class up because it just improves it like a ton more it's insane and with this gun being so overpowered by putting this on it as well it just makes it like 10 times more overpowered so just make sure you do put quick draw on this class because it's absolutely awesome right so we're now going to move on to the gear side of things of the class up as you guys know i always use this and it is stim shot this basically just allows you to heal faster you can actually use this as well as when you're actually running around with your gun in hand so it's really good when you're running around the map and also in this game you can't actually regen like you guys know so by putting stim shot on this weapon be able to regen as i always say when you're in gunfights when you obviously take a few bullets you can just cover yourself take a stim shot regen and just get back into them gunfight so really this class is all about being fast paced but so by putting stim shot on the class you just be able to regen and keep moving and keep that fast pace and that momentum up so make sure you do put stim shot on the class right so we're going to move into the perk side of things of this weapon and the first perk is scavenger the reason i use scavenger is basically because like i said it is more like a run and gun class and trying to like hunt for those kills so by putting scavenger on this class up you can run around kill people pick up the scavenger packs not have it over your head thinking that you're going to run out of ammo and die or that kind of stuff because seriously it can spiral out of control it can go crazy so by putting scavenger in it each kill you obviously the enemy will drop a little scavenger back you can pick it up refill your ammo keep moving keep going keep being aggressive and overall just obviously always have ammo so it's really good to put this on your class so make sure you do put it on right so for the second perk you will have to put perk one greed on this because basically we are using tactical mask on this class this basically just increases your resistance to nine bangs concussions razor wire reactive core seeker tempest fire and county avs the reason i'm using tactical mask because basically i really like the fact of it actually being resistant to nine bangs because nine bangs this game are absolutely crazy out of control basically by putting this on it'll just resist it against those nine bangs i've said this a lot i've always put it on a lot of my class so but by putting this on like i said it'll just it basically just like resist it against those nine bangs i can't stand them and we've been in a, like an aggressive play a lot of players do tend to start using the nine bangs to slow you down so by putting this on like i said it'll just be a resistance to a lot of other things but mainly those nine bangs to so make sure you do put tactical mask on this class right so the third 
and final perk on this class sub is lightweight. This just allows you to run around the map a lot quicker and also it actually takes no fall damage when obviously you jump off things. So obviously you don't want me to take those fall damage. But main thing is, is that it allows you to run around the map a lot quicker. Like I said, this gun class sub is all about being fast paced, getting them running gun kills. That's what it's about. So by putting lightweight on this class sub, you'll be able to run around the map a lot quicker. You'll actually be really surprised how lightweight the um, Maddox actually is. So by putting lightweight on it, you'll be able to run around the map a lot quicker, get your kills, get out the situation you're in if you're in a bad situation as well. But by putting this on, like I said, it's all about just running, gunning, get your kills, get out of there. Yeah, so make sure you do put lightweight on the class. So guys, there you have it. There's the full class setup for the Maddox RFB. It is an assault rifle. It's absolutely amazing. On screen now, you'll be able to see the full class setup together. Please, please, please comment down below your opinions after you've used it. Like, make sure you do use it as well because seriously, it's so awesome. The amount of kills you can get with this, the amount of like turn on, double kills, triple kills you can get with it is insane. You get so many streaks with it as well because this gun is possibly the most overpowered gun ever. If you haven't actually watched my last video, make sure you do because I will put in the description down below. I did play with this gun as well. It's so fun to use. Like, it's just insane. So like I said, make sure you do use it. Comment down below your opinion on it. Ray out of 10, zero minutes trash, 10 minutes absolutely awesome. And yeah, so that's really it. So like I said, that is the full class setup for the Manos RFB. So make sure you do smash that on subscribe, hit that notification button as well to not find when I do a little follow my Twitter. That will be in the description down below. And yeah, so it's been faithful. You guys are awesome. I'll see you guys in the next video. So guys, that's the end of the video. I will do the reaction now, as you can see. But that video was actually amazing, I will actually say, because the editing he does takes a long time. I know that for a fact. He must have a lot of free time on his hand to edit videos like that. I don't know how he could do that. The gameplay he does is excellent. He does really good on the classes of the guns and everything is just perfect it is actually pretty good I will say one thing though I wish he would get an outro I know I don't have an outro and I can't really talk much about that but his videos would be so much better if he had an actual outro which I know what you're all gonna say in the comment section Josh you don't have a fucking outro I don't care I don't have an outro because I don't need an outro. My channel is dead, so we just have that. But yeah, he, his channel would be great with an outro. I want to congratulate him on his special effects, on the editing, his YouTube channel, and I hope one day he can have it as his career. But until that day, he will be growing and he will be in our hearts. Like he said in his video, his Twitter and his YouTube channel are in the link below. Go follow him and subscribe to him. Um, my Twitter may be down there, but sure in the hell, please guys, go subscribe to me and him because that would be 10 times better if y'all did it. And voice crack right there. But thank you guys for watching. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification so you do not miss another video. And like always, keep gaming. Bye.